All right, ladies and gentlemen, once again, thank you so much for tuning in to Eye on the Community. I'm your host, Sean Anthony. Joining us next is Mr. Marlon Platt, the Executive Director for the African American Male Wellness Agency. Mr. Platt, how are you today? I'm doing amazing, Mr. Anthony. Thank you for having me. Good to have you here. So talk to us about the African American Male Wellness Walk and, and how it all got came into fruition. Uh, so the African American Male Wellness Walk started in 2004 uh, in response to a research project that revealed that African American men are dying too soon due to preventable health causes and diseases. And so what we've created is an awareness campaign through a 5K walk and run where we encourage African American men to know their numbers, to get moving, and to see their doctor regularly. And our main focal point is to offer free health screenings to African American men. Why do you think, you know, us men, you know, avoid checking our health and all of that good stuff? Because I understand this is important, but kind of dive a little deeper, man. Why, why do you think that we are so afraid to checking up on our health? I think there's a number of different components. One, you know, we as men have egos. We feel like we're unbreakable and invincible. Uh, I think it has to do a lot with the way that we were brought up in life of, you know, just shake it off or lay down. You know, you don't need to go see a doctor, just be tough and tough it out. Uh, and I think there is a component of fear, uh, fear of finding out some bad news, fear of uh, finding out something that you may not want to uh, learn how to address. Uh, but I think we have to do away with that stigma, not only for our own selves, but also for our families. And so uh, this is a very important call to action for us as African-American men to really do what's most important is to get our health screenings and to know our numbers so that we can take care of ourselves and live longer. And you'll have those resources available at the event uh, this year, right? Absolutely. So we will be providing free health screenings, everything from blood pressure, glucose, uh, BMI, prostate. Uh, we'll be doing mental health and dental screenings. Everything is completely free. All men will have the opportunity to have their results reviewed with a physician. And if they need a referral to a doctor and if they don't already have a doctor, we can refer them to one as well. Uh, and in the meantime, we also have free activities for kids and for seniors. Uh, so it's really an opportunity to bring the whole family together for a day of overall health and wellness. Uh, Marlon, when is that day? Give us the date, the time and location. So the walk is August 14th, which is a Saturday. Every year is the second Saturday in May. Uh, we will be beginning the health screenings promptly at 7 a.m. And then we will have our 5K walk and run start at 9.30 a.m. Over at Livingston Park, which is just outside a nationwide children's hospital. Excellent. Uh, so what do you have planned for, for the walk this year? Anything new or, uh, that we should know about? So we are actually expanding uh, the walk. Uh, we have created an entire Black Men's Health Week. And so we'll have an entire week of programming uh, focused on the health and wellness of African-American men and their families uh, leading up to the walk going from Saturday, August 7th, all the way up until August 14th. Uh, we actually have a Women's Wellness Day this year on Thursday, August the 12th, where we're encouraging men to bring the women in their lives to get health screenings uh, and that's something that we're very excited about. We will also be having uh, a men's worship service on Sunday the 8th, where we're calling Black men from all over the city uh, to come together to pray for each other, uh, to pray for our brothers, our sisters, and our youth, and all together to bring, yourself, uh, bring each other together to be healthier uh, holistically. That's awesome, man. Can I, I just want to ask a little side question here. What would you say the, the demographic of the men that usually participate, do you see uh, a, a younger audience or an older audience? Or, you know, what, what do you, you typically see? So in, in previous years, I would say prior to 2017, 2018, it's been a majority of an older audience. Uh, I would say 45 and up. Uh, people typically think that this is uh, because everything is free. It's an event for, uh, quote unquote, the, uh, those who are impoverished or living below the poverty line, uh, when really it's not. It's just a fact that many of the men who come are working, they have health insurance. They just don't go to the doctor. Uh, I will say in more recent years since I've been here, uh, we have we've seen an increase in attendance from uh, younger black men, the young professional groups, the 28 to 35 year olds. And we hope that trend uh, continues to increase because we know that health is something that you need to practice for the duration of your life, not just as you get into your older years. Absolutely. 
uh, how can people get involved? Uh, people can get involved in a number of different ways. Uh, they can create a passion team, which is just a group of people who are walking for a good cause. Uh, people can volunteer. Uh, they can come help out the day of the event or during the week, uh, especially those who have a background in the medical profession. They can provide free health screenings. And for those who may not have the opportunity to do either of that, uh, they can share. Tell somebody else. Uh, share it on your Facebook. Tell a friend. Bring it up to the people in your church or your fraternity or sorority. Just continue to spread the message about the African-American male wellness walk and the work that we're doing in the community. Mr. Platt, before we go, what, what's the website and is there a phone number that you would like to give out as well? Absolutely. People can find more information at aawellness.org. Uh, that's aawellness.org. Or they can call our office 614-754-7511. And we are also on Facebook and Instagram as AA Wellness Agency. Mr. Platt, it's a pleasure. You're sharp, young man, the executive director for the African-American Male Wellness Agency. Marlon Platt, thank you for sharing this information with us here on Ion the Community, sir. Thank you, Brother Anthony. I appreciate you guys having us. Take care.